Yo, what's going on guys? Are you tired of being a skinny neck mid lane enjoyer? Well, it's time for you to grow up and get down with the thickness, and that is Poppy in the mid lane. She has a really good matchup spread. She can struggle a little bit versus uh, range champs who are also mobile, such as LeBlanc, but you can cancel out her dash with your W. So really her matchup spread is extremely solid. If you are up against a perma range champ, take second win D shield. If you're up against melee, you can get away with going with refill, corruption, or just cloth armor refill like I have here against an old lethality mid laner like Zed, Talon, or even Pantheon. Poppy has over a 69% win rate against Katarina mid, because you can instantly cancel her R with your E, point and click. And she also has a 61% win rate against Silas, Pantheon, Yasuo, and a 58% win rate against Akshan and many others. Poppy mid is highly underutilized. It's going to be a fun game. I'm gonna walk up and hit him right off the bat. What is he gonna do about it? <laughs> Zed said, okay, poppy mid. Yep, that's right, buddy. Good trade. <laughs> All of his health. <laughs> My grass is up. All right, auto into Q. What is he doing? It's like, bro, you're almost dead. You're about to die. <laughs> you gotta back up. I don't think he was taking it seriously. <laughs> I have armor too, so I'm hecka tanky. I want to get my grasp up here. I get him with a Q. I do take a turret shot for it, but my shield blocks a lot of it. I'm not taking much damage from that at all. Gotta keep grasp up for my passive auto. Alright, he's not gonna step up. He's playing really far back. We'll go ahead and pick up our E. Might actually be able to kill him into the, his turret here. Especially if I had Ignite. Pass is about to be up. All right, we're chilling. We'll just force him to farm max range with abilities. He's already chugging through his potions. We'll play away from that. Echo seems like he wants to gank us. Good luck with that. Yep, that's hilarious. Solid Echo gank. 10 out of 10. We'll do again. My grasp is up. Zed doesn't let me have it. He does get my cannon, unfortunately. We trade off a grass bottle with him, trade off another auto. He got his electrocute off for that. That's all right. We'll go ahead and hit biscuit. You want to stay above half health. I think Zed gets extra damage whenever you fall below that. Kind of want to avoid that. He's playing so far back. Not an easy guy to get to at the moment. Get him with that, get him with the grass. Pretty sure his dash is on a cooldown. I'm just gonna reset. Well, actually when I can afford Sheen, I'll reset. Cancel that out, I have to flash that. I would really like to stay for a Sheen. It's starting to get a bit dicey though. I'm starting to get in that kill range for Zed. I think his wave's still coming to me though with how it reinforces first. Yeah, he's still mid. This is so cringe. <laughs> 14 CS Echo. He's got less CS than Shaco because he's riding me so hard. What a goose. You guys duo or what, Zed? I can smell it. Always back for Sheen. We have TP to abuse the uh, refill synergy. And then we have the cloth arm to counter out his lethality. Like I said, against range champs, just go D shield second one. I'm gonna freeze it. I don't have to push. He's trying to bait me out, force me to push. It's like, bro, I'm not gonna. His wave's screwed now, dude. Echo coming mid, hitting me on top of the minions. Yeah, that was a grass sheen proc, buddy. <laughs> That's gonna sting. He's acting like it didn't hurt. He just got purple nurpled. We all know that hurts. Everyone's been purple nerfed at least once in their life by some scumbag. <laughs> oh man. There we go. Yeah, he's going to be down in CS and XP. It's perfect. I need to thin this out. It's actually really easy to stay alive on Poppy Mid if you have TP. If you don't have TP, it can be a little tricky.
We need to get that little buckler. That buckler makes a huge difference in trades if you're able to pick it up or not. If you're not able to pick it up, you'll take a lot more damage. Ooh, good trade for me. He's, he's dead. Yep, nice try. We got him close distance with Eon Dominion. Got him with my Q. Got him with the Sheen proc. The way's still coming to me. I don't have to push here. I have uh, I have my uh, my stuff. Right, we're actually fine here. I'm on biscuits. <clears throat> Got him. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> I sent him away. Uh, <clears throat> Jacob might have to cover mid. Take wave someone. <laughs> That's such a big wave. I, I, I can't really get it either. That sucks. I set up like the perfect wave to where I could reset, come back. I should have been able to catch this, right? I'd have a huge wave. Zed gets nothing. This Echo's a rat, though, man. He's gank bid four or five times. He won't bugger off. I, I miss all of it. All right, there he is. It's pretty funny. Thinks he can tussle with the muscle. I think he's roaming. Yeah, he's bot. I mean, I, I pinged it. There's nothing else I can do. I'm not going to run Zed down. He's already like 10 seconds away from me. Down goes the Renata. My teammates knew and they still chose to kind of play in the river area. Alright, we got to push. I don't have my E, unfortunately, to hit the Zed with there. The minions won't even hit him if he hits me. It's a stupid change they did. So yeah, I can't just sit under here and bully him too hard. I could get him with this Sheen Grasp proc. There it is. Got him with the Sheen Grasp. Got it. Sheen Grasp. Sheen Grasp. I don't have a lot of mana though. Presence of mind would have been alright on this build. That's for sure. <laughs> Waiting for the Echo. Echo's wasted so much time mid. Hit the world's slowest level four. Still wasn't able to kill me. Or even really get me low. That's the thing, trying to gank a lane that's already too far ahead like he did, It's the risk is too high. The risk is you kind of just end up wasting your time, which is exactly what happened. Or even worse, you could end up dying. There's the Sheen Grasp. I could kill him into the wall here. I'll wait for my grass to come up. Eek. Got it. That was sloppy. I didn't get off an auto. I should have E, Q, auto, and then R, but I kind of panicked on that a bit. Walk around him. E, auto, Q. <laughs> These guys, get them out of here. I'm running a clinic on them right now. Right, I got a reset. <laughs> we just auto walk around even to the wall. Cute auto. <laughs> oh boy. They don't have the right chance to fight Poppy with. Not at all. Alright, Jinx. We have tier two boots to get back to lane as well. The only real damage you need early game on Poppy is Sheen. It synergizes well with your passive since your passive applies on hits like Bork, Sheen, Grasp. Yeah, help yourself, Shaco, you little turd. Yeah, that's good. He actually held the wave there. That was good. I just didn't want him to take the whole thing. He actually gets reduced. Junglers get reduced experience from minions for the first uh, 14 minutes. Hey friend, you want to hold that for me? <laughs> it, applied, it applies red buff too because red buff's on hit. So that was a sheen grasp and red buff application there. 
That's hilarious. Might be able to just straight up dive this guy. We'll see. He laid it way too early. He's got my red buff burn on him still there, I think. Auto into Q. I'm not quite underneath the turret, but I am going to die. They're bot lane just casually roaming mid. Jinx gets the shot down. That's not good at all. I don't think Shaco realizes Terrell only scrapes two plates. There's no way to take the whole turret when you lay it like that. Could go for uh, Iceborne. Their team is pretty physical damage heavy. Or we could go for Divine. I think Divine's better. It's a bit more damage. Yeah, we'll play for Divine. After Divine, typically it's Sunfire, or you can play Poppy more kind of bruisery. We really should have drags. Like, we have mid prio need drags. Like, there's no reason we should be losing drags here. There's no point of having winning lanes if you're not going to get drags. It's so pointless. Drags are more important than everything else. Got him with my Divine Sunder hit. He very well might miss my cannon as well. I applied my sheen in midair. I used my Q and then my passive auto applied the sheen proc. Looks like my support's done playing bot lane. She gave it her best effort. Cause I got perma camp mid playing bot 2v2 was too intense. Love sharing experience in turret plate gold. It's really cool. Why don't you? Why don't you sit on that, Zed? He's not even getting experience from these minions. I really don't like sharing gold first turret gold. Sharing my turret plates. Don't like that at all. It's kind of absurd. Echo has 0 KP, Shaco has 1 KP, neither junglers are really doing a whole lot. Echo might have rage quit, his red's up. I would like to roam bot, there's nobody there. Nobody's uh, playing the game. Weird. And there we go. We got to get bot. Support diff says MF. Delusional. Play the game. People get so caught up about how good they are. They forget how to win. We're going to get her with an E and a Q. MF actually has the audacity to try to take that. We got to go back mid. That's so strange to me how a team can be hard winning. But then... Like basically our bot lane's getting carried, right? But then they have the ego to type and say, talk about who's better or who's worse. Even in all chat, it's like raw. I'm, I'm just gonna have to drop the mutes. Incredible. It's almost like they expect someone to say, you're right, MF, you are the best player in this game. It's like, <laughs> in what universe does anybody say that? Even if you are, the best player on the team. Why would anyone even say that you are? It doesn't make sense. All right, I got to reset. I'm low. Zyra chunked me down hard. I don't really know what's worded either. We'll go for the uh, Jinx here in a second. I'm down to play Holebreaker. I think Holebreaker is a little bit juiced all in all. I don't think Jinx is going to see this. Should be able to dive it. I'll w into this, get her with the E, auto Q. Wait, where did she flash to? Oh, she flashed over there. Looks like MF is going to die? Question mark. Oh, cool, she gets away. It's actually really important. You're dead now, Jinx. I think we both know that. 
Jinx almost got the kill because MF decided to go back in. <laughs> All right. We need drags, not heralds. Heralds, you can't really end the game off of them unless you're playing an ultra high elo. And even then, in ultra high elo, drags are best. Heralds need to scrape more than a plate, 1.8 plates. Even Jinx typing in all chat. <laughs> Everybody's typing. It's incredible. Auto and a Q. There goes your health, Cassante. Don't drop the soap. Don't drop the soap. <laughs> w E auto Q R. And that's it. I guess GG's. We'll go ahead and do a part two. They're so quick to give up. And for damage dealt to enemy champions, whoa!